Hello. All right, you guys, this happened in 2019, downtown Los Angeles, City of Angels, around like midnight, 2 a.m. I don't know, but it was late night and I'm Ubering, okay? I Uber out here, I don't do it anymore. <laughs> so I'm driving, I believe it was in Santa Monica, but I got a request from a club and I knew it was gonna be one of two things, right? A group of dudes with no girls, or a group of girls with no dudes. Or it's in LA, sometimes you get like dragons and weird stuff that get into your car. All right, so I pull up to this club, skirt, skirt, and I just know, right? As an Uber driver, you kind of develop like this sixth sense, okay? Like you just know if a ride is going to be complete and total shit. And I knew that, I just felt it. I said, ooh, this is gonna be a bad ride. I just feel it, should I cancel? Should I wait and hope that they don't come out so I can cancel and get this collect, like collect this little cancellation or rider didn't show off fee or whatever, late fee or whatever? I was like, should I do that? I should, huh? So I did that. Right before I could cancel the trip, this girl comes out of the club stumbling and drunk, being carried by her three girlfriends. So they sit there, drunk friend in my car. Let's just call them friends, but they ain't really friends if they did all that. Cause like, why would you put a girl who who's completely just wasted in a in an Uber driver's car by herself? But hey. Put her in the car, but luckily she was really cool, like to the point where I was playing my own music and she started complimenting it. And then she got a little too comfortable. She was saying, can I change it to this? Can I change it to that? Can I hook my phone up to your Bluetooth? Can I see your phone? Then I said, okay, fine. Here's the, here's the aux cable, plug it in, do your thing. Yo, she played Britney Spears. Like I like Britney, bitch. But like she was playing like it's Britney, bitch. Anyway, while the music is playing all out, I can tell when I'm turning and whatnot, she's starting to like move over. She's starting to do one of these in the back. I'm like, she's gonna throw up. Oh my God. Anyway, a few minutes had passed. We got to her destination. She started getting really quiet, like progressively started to get quiet. And I'm like, thank you, God. That means she's going to sleep. Are you okay, sir? Anyway. At this point, she's knocked out. We get to her place. She lived in like this, uh, this like this nice, like big building in downtown LA. She was so knocked out, I could not wake her up. I thought she died in my back seat. Check out this footage. I'm doing all that I can, and I'm not trying to touch her because obviously that can go very, very bad. A drunk white girl in LA being touched by an Uber driver, bro, that has like ABC News, hello. So I didn't want to risk it, and I didn't. But if I did have to, which I think I did end up touching her, but like, you know, to wake her up, right? Check the footage out, man. Let's, let's roll it. Let's, let's roll it. I did my best, okay? But just wake up. Hello? LA crazy, yo. I'm trying to... Hello. I don't want to touch the leg, bro. It could be like a like a lawsuit or something stupid. Hello. I'm not sure I listen to John Mayer, man, in peace. Hello. Hello, 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 hello. You're here. You need help? Hey. Hey. Hey, Ryan. Hey, hey, hey. Hey. Bro, what the fuck? I gotta make money. I got rent, dude. Yo, 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 yo. Hey, 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 hey. Wake up, bro. She just woke up like a demon, and it went back to sleep. Hello, bro. See, this is why you see stuff Uber on the news, man. This is why you see stuff on the news, bro. It's, it's just, it's not the driver's fault, bro. This stuff be happening. And then they, they she gonna claim, she gonna call the cops. Hello? Hello? What the fuck? She's walking inside. She was okay. She got in safe and sound. She came to her senses and she woke up. I didn't get a tip that night. I think that ride ended up being like $30 though. So, hey, I'm cool with that. But the point is this, man. Um, she never tipped me, bro.